Welcome back. Today, I'm gonna go check a trail cam and then, and just hopefully it's still up. Because if it is up, I'll show you kind of why I'm hoping it's still up. <laughs> it's kind of a rinky dinky way to set a camera. But either way, up in the mountains once again, just grinding. All right, we made her. And this is why I say it's rinky dink. <laughs> Look at how it's on there. I always forget what I brought today and is a lock box and then a strap. So good thing it held up. So now I'll be able to see what's been on it the past about month. And then it can still be up for about two weeks until I got to take it down. So that's awesome. Let's get her down and start checking it. Okay, we're getting this thing set up, but I moved it right here because I have been getting a lot of solid bucks on it right in this big area. I don't have any salt, by the way. I had it a few years ago, but there must be just still a little bit, but it's mainly just a huge game trail right through here. So set the camera, lock box. Lots of bears on it this time. I think it's the same big female that I've got in the past like four years and it has two cubs again. So that's pretty cool. And then a super white bear. Um, I forget the name of it, blonde bear. You guys will see after this, but getting this bad boy set up and then we'll be back probably the day before we got to take him down and recheck it. So dang, it's producing dang good though. made it to this pretty badass glassing point. So far, no deer, but as you saw on my trail cam, there's a lot of cool things. So that definitely makes me excited to go and check it again in a few weeks. But it is 7.20 right now, so I got about two hours of glassing. A little less than two hours of glassing, but I think I should be able to turn something up in that time. So, and my four-wheeler has been really trying to shit the bed. Um, I drive about 30 yards, it dies, turns back on, it's fine, drives 30, and then it kind of smells like gas, so I'm assuming it's not getting that much gas, so before it gets too dark, I'm going to head back up this ridge about three miles and go check it out, and I don't know, hopefully I can make it down because it's a long, long drive. It's a few hours on a freaking four-wheeler, but either way, up here doing what I love, like normal, you guys have just been seeing me living life lately, and it's truly just what I love, so that's why I'm doing it. Made it up here in the mountain once again. Beautiful morning out here. 
and right now I'm actually filming a few pretty dang good bucks. One of the better bucks I've seen, honestly, in a few few times being out in this area. So that's definitely good to see. He's just up in this high basin. I decided to hike kind of down in the bottom so you can glass up in these high basins and it worked out. So as you guys saw, there's a few cool bucks on my trail cam. And now, as you'll see in a second, a few cool bucks filming through the all in. And I just want to remind you guys that there's still 25% off on anything at allin.co if you use code big time. So it'll save you money and it'll help me support me in a different way by giving me a kickback because you guys use my code. Thank mm -hmm. you. 